If hand sanitizer kills 99.99% of germs, then who are those boozer 0.01% who survive? The first is one we'd really wanted to work on called norovirus, which causes diarrhea and vomiting outbreaks in places like cruise ships and schools. It's superior to many other viruses in this regard because it has a protein capsid, which is resistant to the effects of the alcohol. The next is Enterococcus physium, which I probably don't need to explain, lives in the gut. Mutations in the way that it absorbs carbohydrates and its ability to form this gooey slime-like substance called biofilm make it resistant to alcohol. And another we'd really, really want it to work on is Clostridium difficile. This causes horrendous diarrhea and vomiting in hospitalized patients, and it has a remarkable ability to respond to environmental stresses, including alcohol gel, by going to sleep. It quite literally produces spores and then slows all metabolic activity. Soap and water 